Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. I'm Derek Ray, and keeping me company here on the commentary gantry is Stuart Robson. And today the focus falls firmly on the National Women's Soccer League. It's O.L. Rain, and they take on the Portland Thorns. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. This is how the starting lineup looks today. Well, in this shape, if their wide players stay high up the pitch and get enough of the ball, it's a very attacking lineup. But if they drop too deep, they will then leave the centre forward isolated and it could be difficult for them. A look at the opposition starting lineup today. Well, the shape is the same, but they may play it in a slightly different way. And key to this game will be the fullbacks. Do they tuck in alongside their centre halves or look to support their wingers? I hope it's the latter. And this confrontation is underway. Sonnet. Barnes. Now here's Rapino. Jordan Heitema. Just the challenge that was required. Crystal Dunn, good movement, and credit is due for that good piece of defending. Lavelle, there to win it back. We're racing away here. Still a chance, but not to be, it is offside. Sofia Huerta. On to Dunn. Oh, getting the ball forward. Clean challenge. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. Well, the card is out, and it's yellow. Yeah, it's clumsy, and it's late. Definitely a yellow card. This to open the scoring here. And there it is, perfectly executed.
Well, here it is again, and just watch the keeper. She stands still, hoping it's hit down the middle. Unfortunately for her, she's got it wrong. And back underway, 1-0 it is. Heitema. Moving into the advanced position. Now can she pick out a teammate? And the attack finally comes to nothing, and the keeper has it. And the referee blows the whistle, it is a free kick. Determined defending. Sonnet. Sofia Huerta. Superb effort to keep it in. Well, they get themselves level here. A terrific piece of goalkeeping. Now sending it in. Can she apply the finishing touch? Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Trying to deliver it accurately. Making sure nothing came of it. Needs to tread carefully. Rapino! And it's in! All square again! What a match this is turning out to be! Well, here it is again, and she's just been caught on the ball. That's a complete lack of awareness. It's a poor bit of play, really. So back underway, following the equaliser. Can she find the right pass? Pressing high to win the ball. Can they nudge in front? Blocking it. Body in the way again. Sinclair. Counter-attacking very much an option. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Jordan Heitema. Well, they've lost the ball. Free kick awarded then by the referee. She's made a really important challenge. Weaver gives it a go oh that was begging to be put home but the goalkeeper has it well there you have it they haven't been good enough going forward they've created very little so far they need to play with much more urgency
A bit sloppy in possession. And the referee blows for a foul. Alana Cook, disappointing pass. Done. Christine Sinclair. Sam Coffey. Well, sloppy in possession. Now we look towards the referee because she might decide that further action is required. Yellow card earlier. Well, play stopped. It is a free kick. Pressing high, and they have the ball again. Oh, marvellous goalkeeping! Well, it's a top-class save from a top-class goalkeeper. That's absolutely brilliant. And there's the delivery. That is a... And the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty given. Now to restore their lead here. In it goes. Carly converted. Well, here we can see it again. Keeper's gone the wrong way, and it makes for a fairly easy finish in the end. That's how to take a spot kick. Well, as they kick off again, 2-1 the current state of affairs. And three minutes will be added on for stoppages. Well, really on top of her game. Takes aim! Well, it wasn't a simple save to make. And they will make the change now. Who can they pick out? And the problem not completely solved. And in the end, no damage done. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. Not what you want to be doing when you've already been cautioned.
Really good attacking play. Oh, good work by the keeper. Lauren Barnes. So a throw in here. Oh, great attacking play. This could square the game. Oh, right in the nick of time. Smith. Struggling to keep the ball. It should be. Oh, tremendous work from the keeper to avert the danger. Well, that save just about keeps them in this, but they have to pose more of a threat at the other end. Could be! Well, I don't think that effort remotely qualifies as respectable. And the reason it's off target, because the technique was really poor on that occasion. That's not a good effort. Rose Lavelle. Moving the ball nicely. Trying to carve out the equaliser. But then the one that fails to hit its target. The referee's letting it go as they keep the ball. Well, as things turned out, no advantage accrued to them. And she's awarded the free kick. But it is a caution. And stay calm might be the instructions that should come from the manager. Yeah, you're absolutely right. If they're not careful, they're going to lose another player fairly soon. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Raquel Rodriguez. Now looking dangerous here. Surely! What a vital intervention! Thirty minutes to go then. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. A chance to whip it in. Really important piece of last-ditch defending. No foul play, says the referee. Becky Sauerbrunn. Crystal Dunn. Now with Sinclair. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Needs to tread carefully. Veronica Latsko. Can they hit on the break? Oh, maybe the equaliser. And still a chance. Oh, and there's the goal they were looking for. They're doing this the hard way. Down as they are to ten. Well, I have to say, the keeper's done really well on the first shot, as you can see. But it's gone straight to an opponent and nothing she can do about the second strike. Well, back underway here. And they've split the four goals between them so far. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking it to come, you would think. Well, the card is out, and it's yellow. Yeah, it's clumsy and it's late. Definitely a yellow card. into the final 20 minutes high quality defending Veronica Latsko 
Moving it forward. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. And the referee spotted the foul, but has played advantage. Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. The play having stopped, a chance for the referee to go back and hand out the caution. Christine Sinclair. On to Fishlock. Lauren Barnes. Rapino. That's useful play. Good pressure high up the pitch. Christine Sinclair. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. And the search goes on for a winner. Time is tight. Oh, it's off the post. And problem solved for now. Well, that would probably have been the winner. It's so unlucky. Is there going to be a dramatic finish here? Let's hope so. Yes, so near indeed. But now they've got to concentrate on... And it goes! And it might be the goal that gives them the bragging rights. Huge drama here late on. Well, here it is again. What a good build-up this is. Quick, incisive passing, clever movement, and all done at pace, which led to a simple finish. That's a real joy to watch. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Well, doesn't have to do it on her own. Getting in there to intercept. Well, do they have it in them to level this? Elise Bennett on to King and there she is in with a chance in it goes to increase their advantage and will that be the goal that ends up securing it for them Well, just look at the defending here. The keeper is left totally exposed. It's an easy goal in the end, but well taken. So the current scoreline, 4-2. The referees, the tackle completely mistimed and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. Well, it is a yellow card and the referee having a word. Well, if they're not careful, they're going to lose a couple more players here. They've completely lost their discipline. They're out of control at the moment. Can she find the right pass? Winning the ball back. What can she do from here? And it's going to go into the history books as a victory for O.L. Reign. Stuart, I wonder how you would sum up their display. Well, Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game, particularly in that midfield area, and they also looked threatening in the top third of the pitch. It's a really good result for them.